Hello everyone, thank you for coming to our presentation. Um, we're doing our presentation on the pizza oven and the promotional strategy right now and also into the future. A little bit of what we're going to be going over today is the company background, the current situational analysis, communication objectives, promotional plans to support the objectives, evaluation plans, and references. A little company background on the pizza oven is they are a pizza shop located in Canton, Ohio. There are several locations around the uh, Northeast Ohio area. The specific one we're talking about will be Papa Bear's, which is located in Belden. They are a family owned business and they have been in business since the 1950s. They focus on fresh ingredients and excellent customer service, and they serve their signature pastas chickens, pizzas across the Canton area as well. Currently at Papa Bear's, there's a new age coming in of a lot of changes. Um, a lot of these changes show extreme promise and a lot of great things to come for this organization. Um, currently, there's um, they just begin operation at two new locations. The first location being in Navarre, Ohio, and the second location being in Alliance, Ohio. These two locations were areas where there was a large concentration of customers um, that were outside of the delivery areas and the um, immediate area of other locations that they would have to travel um, a decent distance to be able to purchase and uh, receive product from Papa Bears and Pizza Oven. Um, this is kind of hinting at a larger expansion possibly coming in the future um, this expansion could encompass all of no Northeast Ohio. Um, I know currently there's a large uh, demand up into the Green area, into the Akron area, and even down into the Tuscaroras area and um, down into Magnolia and East Canton and all those places. Um, current, uh, the current situation as it relates to the COVID-19 pandemic, the pandemic ushered in a large amount of changes um, that basically Papa Bear's and Pizza Oven adapted in order to stay afloat and stay alive during this um, pandemic. Um, the restaurant sides obviously were closed due to regulations and restriction put, uh, implemented by the, um, the Ohio State government. Um, with that, they began um, two new services into the carryout side that have really opened up um, a new channel to reach customers while making them feel safe. These channels are curbside pickup and no contact delivery. These two um, services have really allowed a lot of customers who in the past hadn't felt safe or hadn't had the ability to come and pick up the food in store or in the restaurant area to now be have that service accessible to them. Um, Another, uh, recently, the restaurant began to open back up and um, you're starting to see a lot more of the customers come back into the restaurant side um, and they, they're starting to feel comfortable uh, now that masks are being implemented and uh, co uh, COVID protocols, as well as uh, social distancing guidelines are being followed there. Um, I know currently they're um, Papa Bears in order to usher in um, a large amount of people are beginning to host uh, pre and post games for uh, athletic teams that will be playing in the Northeast Ohio area. So specifically, um, team, other college teams coming in to play Malone and Walsh University come to this restaurant for their pregame and postgame meals uh, for their athletes. And to compound onto that, you'll have um, the swimming state finals. And um, I know there's uh, a large concentration of playoff teams for basketball that are also in this area that they, they actually have their uh, post-game meals at Papa Bears and they, uh, the opposing teams that they play have them there as well. Uh, this really uh, expands the clientele and gets new faces in and new, new customers in that they can try the food, they can 
taste the freshness. They taste the uh, time and uh, effort put into this food that's going to bring them back and make them uh, repeat customers. Next, we have the communication objectives. Communication involves transmitting, receiving, and processing information. The goal of a communication objective is to tra transmit information about your brand. The consumer will receive the communication, then in processing this information, they will form a positive conclusion about the brand. Although the pizza oven was established in 1956, many people do not know about the company. Therefore, the communication objective that we will focus on in order to promote the pizza oven will be brand awareness. Increasing brand awareness will allow the pizza oven to become a household name. Branding begins with awareness, which may be achieved by featuring the brand name prominently in repeated advertisements. We will want an ad that shows people the pizza oven is the preferred pizza over other competitors. Those competitors who will not be named will not have the freshest ingredients while the pizza, pizza oven will. Some promotional plans to support the objectives. Our number one plan is basically creating a fun way to have a customer build their own pizza with the fresh and natural ingredients. There are um, many local pizza shops in the area, but there is one that is called Blaze Pizza that many people may be familiar with. And there's also a pizza shop um, in the United States called Mod Pizza. And they actually have where the customer can come in and it's like almost like a Chipotle for pizzas. So you can go ahead and see what you want on your pizza. You can customize it any way you want. Um, usually they have standard, uh, if you want like a margarita pizza or meat lovers, those are just regular prices, but you can also do a build your own at a standard price as well. And for the ingredients, we're gonna be using local ingredients, mostly from farmers and farmers markets. We really wanna be able to support local businesses because Pizza Oven is a local business and it's kinda of like giving back to the community in a way. So to do this, we wanna be able to advertise that and post it in the Pizza Oven shops and also on social media. Um, social media is gonna be our plan number two in advertising and marketing it. So using Facebook and other local outlets such as newspaper and radio stations, which are more of the traditional way to advertise. And this will increase the geographical distance and the way that we can reach more people by doing this. If we just did kind of a standard, um, maybe like local television, it wouldn't really get out further um, than locally, but really using social media and radio stations will be able to enhance that as well. The next step in the promotional plan to support the objectives are recommendations. First, the pizza oven should hold an open house for customers to try out their pizza. Holding an open house is a way for consumers to come and see the changes that have been made and learn more about the company during which customers will be able to create their own pizza with fresh ingredients. This will create first-hand experiences and be the start of a company and consumer relationship. Next is buying local ingredients from farmer's market. This is a way that the pizza oven will use product attributes to set the restaurant apart from other pizza places. The use of fresh ingredients puts the pizza oven way ahead of their competitors. Fresh ingredients create a better taste and it's way better for consumers who are eating it. And using local products helps build the community strength behind the pizza oven. Next is the pizza oven should create authentic radio ads describing what deals they are currently offering. The use of radio is a channel of marketing that will create effective frequency, which refers to the number of times a target audience must be exposed to a message to achieve the objective, and a radio ad allows for multiple exposures and a range of audiences who will hear this multiple times. Then, make a newspaper ad with coupons. 
this will help the overall brand awareness because two fountains create a great initiative for consumers to come in. Not only that, but for the pizza oven to evaluate if the ads are being seen and or used. Next is having customers leave reviews on Facebook. This is essential because reviews on social media, it brings up the pizza oven's page to consumers who may not be following their page and it allows for word of mouth to be spread, which is the cheapest and best form of advertisement. Next is, is the promotional plan to support objectives, the budget section. The budget is what essentially de determines what the pizza oven can do. Since the communication objective is to increase brand awareness using an object, objective and task budget would be the best. This is when management identifies what needs to be communicated through the year. Breaking down the budget week by week, the overall cost will be spending about $2,680. Breaking it down, the biggest cost is implementing the new and fresh ingredients. Allowing $2,000 gives cushion because depending on the month and depending on the local farmers, prices will vary. But it is better to have more in the budget and spend less than vice versa. Then, using traditional marketing with radio and newspaper ads, it will cost about $200 to run a 30-second ad on the radio, and about $480 to have weekly ads in the local papers, both of which are traditional, which will reach consumers of all demographics, and that is really what we're trying to do when we're trying to really get the name of the pizza oven out there. This evaluation plan is to make sure that pizza oven sells all their products fresh, um, fresh, hot, and ready in order for them to be the number one pizza shop in Canton, Ohio. Um, the, the audience I was targeting are people who like pizza and who like their pizza um, nice and fresh and delicious as well. As stated on Pizza Oven's website, all of their food is really great and they do not have any bad reviews. So this shows how committed they are to their customers. So as mentioned in the book, um, Customer service is definitely key to keeping your customers up to par and to keeping your business successful as well. Pizza Oven makes fresh ingredients every day for their products, for their products and, sh and should be the best pizza shop, as stated in Canton, Ohio again. They also care about what their customers think. Customer satisfaction is definitely key, as I said before. Um, for success to be measured and for Pizza Oven to be successful, um, they should make sure all their food is fresh, which they definitely do make sure all their food is fresh, delicious, um, great for the customer so they can keep coming back um, and determine what goals they want to accomplish every day in order to keep their customers and in order to gain new customers as well. Here you can see our print ad for the newspaper. The print ad here was designed using techniques from our promotional strategy. To begin, the ad mentions the pizza oven brand at the top and the bottom. This will allow the consumer easy recognition and recall. The slogan of, we don't cut corners, only slices, was created to tell the customer that they will only be getting the freshest ingredients, but in a unique and fitting way. This will also allow the consumer to connect with the product and the company, since they know that the brand that they're using and buying they don't have to worry about the ingredients or where they're coming from, unlike other competitors. We also promote their customizable pizzas and show these fresh ingredients that are utilized. The next stage of this ad hits on the company's locations, which are all around Canton and Maslin. It also shows their Facebook page, which will allow the company to promote for free, unlike this print ad, which will cost money. A coupon is utilized at the end in the shape of a stop sign to get the consumer's attention and let them know that just by mentioning this ad, they will get a 15% off. Um, this will also help promote marketing or word of mouth. The success of this ad can be measured using three evaluation techniques or methods. The message online and respondent techniques. If sales increase, then we can determine that the ad was successful. 
And here are our references. We, as a group, we really just want to bring awareness to Pizza Oven and who they are as a company. We are hoping that this gives Pizza Oven the opportunity to look at other avenues in marketing objectives. We want them to be as successful as possible and reach out to the local population and essentially bring in more customers and more business as well. We really appreciate your time and consideration. And if you have any questions for us, please let us know. Um, we really appreciate it. Thanks for watching our presentation.